I'm AZD Arasa Park. D Bazaar. Let's talk about one of the most important things in my life. Super f***ing heroes. Gods and superheroes. Gods, superheroes, titans. These guys, look. Let me show you what I got on my table. Look at this grown man. Look at that. Doctor Strange, Venom. Now, that's kind of cool. If you're a guy and you're watching, you go, oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. You go, you're like me, man. You're like me. You ain't grown up. We're ageless. The body grows. The timeless one is inside. Superheroes, gods, titans, animals. You're like, dude, this has all kinds of toys here. You better believe it. But they ain't toys. They're called totems. Big difference. Tail up now. <laughs> Watch out. Well, let's, let me tell you what I know. Because I believe that man can rise to greater heights than what we were told. I believe that there are people out there who have surpassed the human limits many times. I found them in the martial arts. I found them in yoga. I found them in gymnastics. I found them in Zen Buddhism. I found them in all kinds of different things that I would study in Taoism. I found men who had surpassed what we were told growing up it meant to be a human and a man. And for myself, Bruce, let's say Bruce Lee, shout out to Bruce Lee, the man. He was the first superhero I saw. 135 pound guy, moving so fast, so strong, so confident, so intelligent, facing the opponent like it's nothing. One man against all odds, still standing up tall, never showing fear. Never showing uh, any sort of flinch against the enemy. Always totally confident. Have you seen Bruce Lee? You should go check out Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee had godlike confidence and so does AZD. Do you know when I started to formulate this idea? Man, three, four years old, I see Bruce Lee. He's not afraid. He stands up to any opposition. But Bruce Lee was the original beast. And now... Worldwide, IMC Nation men do beasts, beast routines. We're all beasts. I've awakened the beast in everybody as it was awakened in me by, by Manu Tupo, my teacher. Now, Bruce Lee was the first man I saw who became a beast, what I call a beast. That was some dope as a little kid growing up. I didn't like Conan the Barbarian. He was way too big. I was way too small. So that was not me, dude. I, I would like to, like, I would look at his, his comrades, look for the guy who kind of was my height, my size. And that guy always had some kind of magical powers with animals. And like an eagle on his hand, or they would have like a dog with them. They weren't strong enough, but they had whew, communication with the environment. So I wanted to do that because I was little. See, when people are around, of course, I'm respectful. I'm kind. I'm considerate. I take them into account. <sighs> When nobody's around, it's just me and whoever what spirits are watching. I am not any of those things. I'm an unleashed monster. And that's our routine. Every day, men of IMC Nation who call themselves shape-shifting warrior fighting monks. That's myself and around 30-something people or 27. I don't know how many there's now. They wear beads like myself. They check in on my Instagram. AZD, IMC, 408, NorCal. We need role models. And we have them, but someone's been hiding them from us. There is men who have come before us who are superheroes. Socrates is a superhero. Malcolm X is a superhero. Muhammad Ali is a superhero. Tupac was a superhero. Bruce Lee was a superhero. Masashi was a superhero. Oh, Sensei, these are martial arts, was a superhero. There's been some real men here. And we come in that tradition. And this video blog is to remind you that you do have the potential to rise way above going to school, getting a job, getting married, having a, a two kids, buying a golden retriever, getting a white picket fence, buying two cars, then maybe a little boat, go on a vacation. Then after about five, six years, you go to Vegas with your girlfriends, he goes to whatever, and then you just start cheating on each other. After a while, you break up, your kids are... That's the storyline. There's more to life than that. You could be, you could, you could reach your potential. And nobody knows your potential but you. So on one hand, right, worldwide, people admire me. And they 
He should. I admire myself more than they could ever admire me. And that's something I want to teach you. If the world is clapping for me like this, then I'm clapping for me like this. And if the world is clapping for me like this, oh, you're great. I'm going, yeah, you're the best. If they're doing that, I'm standing ovation. That Why? Because I'm my biggest fan. And for that reason, my biggest fan is here right now. And he's standing there going, woo! Go AZD! Let the No! Put these in their place! Give these men back the Speak your truth! You are a superhero! Prove me wrong! Come and find out! Well, like Clark Kent. <laughs> I think I was cuter the other way. But f being cute. While I get cuter. I'm my biggest fan. I do a video blog for me. Knowing you're gonna benefit. Knowing I'm not alone. Knowing that nobody could ever really clap for me. How do you feel when you see a man who's so committed to his purpose? Who's so strong? Look, I ain't gonna bend. I'm not here to impress you. Like I said, I'm impressing me. See, if I impress you, but that don't impress me, when you walk away and you go, hey, good job, I'm like this. Hmm, didn't do too good. Right? You go, oh my God, you were so great. I'm like, ah. Why? Because I know. But on the other hand, let's say I know what I did. I know what I put in. I know what it took to be here. So one of these rules that we have at IMC Nation for men and women, it's one of these rules that really helped me out. It's already 15 minutes. I cannot believe that. Let's go quick. These, this rule is this. Okay, ready? We speak and we, we are here, not for our critics. This is backwards. You've been growing up learning how to please the critic. She doesn't approve of you? He doesn't approve of you? Oh, my. if you're watching this and you're a woman and you've been around me before, and yeah, I know you guys are watching. You know that the moment that you said something that I thought you don't approve of me, I literally kicked you to the curb. Like literally, like get out. They go, well, that's harsh. Listen up. If you can find a better man, go get it. If not, shut the You're not here to criticize. You're not here to teach. You're not. You're here to be led. To be led. I lead, you follow. I'm survival, you're not. Shut the That's why the world is suffering. And guess what? A man is to lead. I am so sick of these men that can't lead. I need some leaders around me. Why? Are you kidding me? To even ask that question, you're... We need to lead. First, you lead yourself. First, you clap for yourself. First, as a man, you get the... You look in the mirror and you become proud of yourself. Proud. Proud. Like you have an S on your chest. Superman could suck my... Faggot. Imagine being Superman and being so pathetic. Lois Lane. Imagine being Thor and being so pathetic. Whatever his name is. All we saw growing up was the Hulk, the Thor, Spider-Man, Superman, Batman. Should I keep going? Go to arisapar.com. That's my website. That's where you find my products. And subscribe to this channel. This is AZD. This is IMC Nation. Be the best and the best. Yo.